Today on RCV TV, we're going to be taking a look at the Heracles Plus by Sense. Alright folks, so here we got the Heracles Plus by Sense. I'm going to show you what comes in the package and show you how to fill it up. So of course, obviously you get your tank. Underneath this flap here, we've got a spare piece of glass and another coil. The coil that comes installed in it is a .4 Canthal coil. It's rated for about 35 to 100 watts. The spare one is a .2 stainless steel, rated for about 35 to 80 watts. Right here it's got some filling instructions. So there you have it for what comes in the package. Let's go over a couple features of the tank. Down here you've got your standard airflow control ring. Now it doesn't snap into any positions, but the tension on it is, is really tight, so it's going to hold its position real well for you. Up here you've got a little bit more extra airflow. Up underneath the drip tip, add a little bit more airiness to the, to the vape for you. It does have a removable 510 drip tip, so if you want to change it up with any of your standard 510 drip tips, they should fit. So let's go about priming this coil and filling the tank. Get at your coil to prime it and to change it. Gonna hold the glass, unscrew the base. Now here you go. Coil just screws in and out of the base just like that. So if when you burn your coil out, very very simple. Unscrew the base, unscrew your coil, toss the old one away, screw a new one in. Juice we're gonna be using today in this tank is called Sup Ohms from the Watts Up line. 3 milligram. This is a creamy cinnamon churro. So to prime these coils, I go all the way around the top like that. Let that soak in for a second. And then I start going around to these side wicking holes. And I continue to put juice on these really until it stops soaking it in. These coils can hold a lot of juice, so this can sometimes take a little while. Now this is obviously the stainless steel version of the tank. It also comes in a black. So once I go around the sides, I come around and put another round up top. Now this is a top fill tank, so we're just going to throw this base back in. I'm going to show you how to fill it from the top. Now if you can see right here, it says on, off. With this tank to fill, you need to shut off the juice flow. So what you're going to do is you're going to hold the glass and turn that ring. Oh, this one's tight. There we go. Now you're going to unscrew the top. You don't want to get it down that center tube, so you're going to use one of those two side holes. Just put the needle tip of the drip or the bottle in there and fill her up. I keep putting it in until it starts coming out those two holes in the top. And there we go. Just to that point. So, I'm going to put the cap back on there. And then I'm going to open up the juice flow holes. So there we go. You'll see some bubbles coming up the sides there. All right. Well, that is how to fill the Heracles Plus. I'm going to go up top and uh, have a vape on it. All right. So there you have it. The breakdown of the Heracles Plus tank and how to fill it. Let's take a vape on it. We've got her set at 35 watts, which is the lowest wattage setting. Anytime you're breaking a coil, you want to start at the lowest wattage setting. Slowly work your way up as you're vaping through a tank of juice. 
Now I do have it on the 200 watt Fuchai. For more information on the Fuchai, check out our link below to our video. All right, let's have a vape. There you have a 35 watt vape on the Herc Plus. Decent flavor out of this sucker. A lot of airflow. I've got the top airflow closed down. I've got the lower airflow closed or turned all the way up. I'm going to actually close it off a little bit. That's a little nicer. All right, folks, thanks for watching. And as always, subscribe to the channel, like the videos, follow us on Instagram and Twitter, like us on Facebook. And until next time, make, make smart, smart choices. choices.